Hello Africans, my lesson focuses on finite and non-finite verbs. Verbs are words that describe actions, conditions, or experiences. Examples, watch, see, love, like, believe, etc., and etc., Finite verbs describe the main action in a sentence. Finite verbs change form according to the subject. They also show the tense of a sentence. Example, Mary likes eating food. Mary is the subject. Likes is the verb. The verb like has S at the end because the subject Mary is in a singular form. Another example, they like eating food. The verb like does not have S at the end because the subject they is in a plural form. Therefore, the word like is a finite verb. Its form is informed by the subject of a sentence. It also shows a tense of the sentence. Example, Mary likes eating food. The verb likes indicates that the sentence is in simple present tense. Note the following. Finite verbs change their form if the subject changes in number either in singular or plural, or if the tense of a sentence changes. Example, Mary liked eating food. The verb liked is now in the simple past, and it agrees with the subject of a sentence Mary. Let us look at the non-finite verbs. Non-finite verbs do not change to agree with the subject. They also do not change form if the subject changes in number, or if the tense of a sentence changes. Non-finite verbs can be either present or past participles. Present participles are non-finite verbs that end in ing. Examples, speaking, loving, writing, etc., and etc. Past participles are non-finite verbs that end in ed. Examples, talked, cried, kicked, etc. and etc. Some irregular verbs have past participles that do not end in ed. Examples, beaten, spoken, bent etc. and etc. Here are more examples. 1. Peter kicked a bouncing ball. 2. Sipo is playing tennis. 3. She was marking a test. 4. I have spoken the truth. The verb kicked and auxiliary verbs is, was, have are finite verbs because they agree with the subjects, and they also show a tense of these sentences. These verbs, bouncing, playing, marking, spoken, are non-finite verbs, because they do not agree with the subjects, and also do not change form if the subject changes in number, or if the tense of a sentence changes. Please, Follow my next English lesson.